just get back on track with the tips. That, that, that's just amazing. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> playing hard, playing fast, and playing physical. It's not enough that you are fast. Okay? Like that's why we have, we went against Bay Lynn, man. Bay Lynn. Okay? But what's the use of being fast if you don't play fast? It's neutralized. If I'm fast and I don't use it on that field, it don't matter. It don't matter. So that's what we're about, man. We're about playing fast. Not being fast. We're about playing. That's that whole thing where I can't breathe, man. You can't breathe when you just got bodies flying to the ball like that. You got to play fast. Now, y'all know we want to see y'all go out there and do that. Because y'all got speed, man. But we need to see y'all use that speed. Use your speed, man. Playing hard. What that entails, look here. I got to I gotta reach this man. But this man fighting me to the outside. I'm not going to just give it up because he's fighting me. He's supposed to fight you. He's supposed to. He got a job to do too. But playing hard is not. I'm supposed to reach him. I'm going to reach him. He's stretching me. I'm going to reach him. He's stretching me. I'm going to reach him. It's playing hard. And playing physical. <coughs> man, when you bust people in the mouth, dog, it's like a boxer, man. You always got somebody going forward. You always got somebody going back. You never see two people just standing in the middle of the ring. We're going to dig shit. That's what we're going to do. We're going to initiate. All right? We're going to play physical because I'm going to have to find out. Everybody made up of something different, but I'm going to bust you in the mouth and see how you respond. I ain't going to finesse with you. I ain't going to do all this sissy shit with you. I'm going to bust you in the mouth and see how you respond. I'm going to see what you made of. You'll be surprised how many teams, how many people, individually, tuck their tail and run. Because that coach flipping on me, man, that coach is what I'm going through out there. All right? So we want y'all to bust people in the mouth, play fast, take their will, man. I don't know how many people have a box or how many people know about boxing. But that chin bone somehow is connected to that knee bone. You rub that chin and knee shape, they can never get it back. I'm telling you, they can never get it back. Man, you tap that, you ain't never gonna be like this again, that whole match. And that's what we're looking for. We're gonna rain ear holes, and we're gonna just straight up bust them in the mouth. And we're gonna probably be using that weight room, physically dominate them. That's what general's gonna be about. And you can't co-sign that, man, y'all the wrong spot. That's for real. And that's what we about. Playing hard, playing fast, and playing physical. Next one is expectations. What we expect from each player <coughs> during practice. Feel me to go, fellas. Be attentive to detail. <coughs> like the illustration I just did there, my man. If we say behind the line, that means behind the line. If coach get on you for not being behind the line, is coach fucking with you, man? No, because just get behind the line. Just get behind the line. It's that simple. Behind the line, be behind the line. So let's be attentive to detail. If you're supposed to punch this number, don't punch this shoulder because I'm getting lost in this player. So man, my assignment is to punch his number. I'm gonna punch his number because I'm being attentive to detail. Next one, discipline yourselves. Discipline yourselves so we don't have to. That go hand in hand with the first one. Behind the line, man, don't they move Oh man, we about y'all. Y'all, we here for y'all. We not here to just punish you for doing stuff, but we discipline what's required to be champions, man. And we'll be failing y'all as coaches if we let if, if we let y'all get away with that little little garbage stuff that losers do. We're not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it. So discipline yourself so we don't have to. Be mentally tough. Man, a son gonna be out there. Ain't no way around. And I learned this in college, man, because you're like, damn, maybe some days you just ain't up for it. You gotta be mentally, mentally tough. That I mean that son beating down on you. That son, yeah, that son ain't going over. That son is not leaving. So you gotta find a way to look. You gotta find a way to accept that as part of the game and love it. So you gotta be mentally tough no matter what's going on. Look, coach running you, damn, I can't run, I can't take time with my friends. How many times y'all feeling like y'all just scam, I can't gasp another breath? But the minute y'all on that knee, when coach talking to you, you don't even feel none of that. You feel it for the moment. That's where that saying comes from, that pain is temporary. And it's temporary. Y'all on the knee, y'all ain't even thinking about the gas that y'all just ran. So that's the mental toughness part. Understand that it's going to pass. Understand that it's just the just feeling that I feel right now. That shit breaks on people. I was in a, when I was in camp, we had discipline, we would wake up at 5.30 in the morning, go to the gym. And we doing constant work for an hour. Like constant work for an hour, 5.30 in the morning. That was our discipline. We, we pushing towels up and down, we doing all that. The total time in between that hour that you got rest was probably two minutes, total. That's from this little trans transition to that transition. We was in there at 5.30. We had to be there at 6.30. A cat came in there late. 
he came in there like at, at 545, gave up his scholarship at 550. He took five minutes worth of that shit and gave it up. Because too much for him at the time. Because he had none of this thing. He had no metal about him, man. You gotta be mentally tough no matter what we throw y'all. Understand it's temporary, man. They ain't never killed nobody. Continually improve. And, and all y'all probably heard it, man. You get better or you get worse. You never stay the same. And that's real as real. If you're going there through the motions, because damn, I'm supposed to be the practice. We're going to be the practice time. Consciously get better. Apply yourself to get better. Damn, I watched film. I took a step back this time. Let me make sure I ain't making that same mistake twice. I was raised my whole life because only assholes make the same mistake twice. Like, for real. Show me how to do it. I did it. Now, how am I going to move backwards from that? So continue to get to improve, man. Continue to improve. Take mental repetition. This is a big deal. That's like college. If you went to college, they give you a syllabus. It's like this is what we're going to cover. Okay? I'm not going to be babysitting you or pacifying you and telling you that you do this. Oh, man, they give you that syllabus. This is what we got to knock down. Knock it out. That's what mental reps is. Coach had to get on the, what he had to, he had to get on the smart the other day, but because you lost. Even though we're not in the game or you're not in practice, Listen, man, because once you get thrown in them walls, man, you got to be ready to go. You got to be ready to go, so take mental rest. Look, get in the habit of doing this. Get in the habit of doing this here. Okay, Tyler's in right now. I pay Tyler position. Coach talking to him. I'm listening because he's talking to me, too. I'm taking mental reps. As he step, I'm critiquing his steps. Like, damn, okay, he did that great. I would have did it this way. He did that wrong. Be in the game, man. Be in the game because, look, we're going to call you. You're going to be like, damn, coach ain't playing nobody. There should be no fall offs when Coach substitutes somebody because you're ready. You've been watching the man before you. You've been taking a little rest. When Coach and that hold talking to people, y'all never paying attention. Take concerns after you. Let's go back to him. Practice as if you start. When I was at Jackson, man, I played Boston in ninth grade. Coach Amandre led a four years on Boston, ninth grade. Ninth grade, because no, we ain't get there and act inferior to whoever them seniors might have been. Whatever we reflect on that field, just what it was. Just what it was. I practiced if I was start. I just played tackle on concrete like a knucklehead, man. Because I am, my man, I, I love that game like that, though. I don't expect people to do that. You know, that was just, well, look, we're going to play tackle on concrete. We want to do that. But you got to practice if you the starter, man. Don't act like you're inferior to nobody. You can take your mental rest, which go back on the last one. You been knowing. Little Rodney, Little Rodney, man, I'm finding out here, little mosquito. He executed his assignment by shitty as hell, but he gonna annoy you, man. He gonna annoy you. He gonna feed you. That. You're like, God damn, man, you living over here and somebody can still owe you. But that's what he is. Now, see, my thing with that, I like that in him, because for him to go backwards now, for him to not be that pest, that means he picked up a bad habit somewhere. Because he already got that part where he gonna work for six seconds. He already got that part. So now we just gotta clean it up, clean up everything around it. But my thing, man, practice is a few to start. I don't wanna act like because this dude was here or because he got all that recognition, because of this, because of that. No, man, I, I feel I'm entitled just like the next man. Now it's time to go short. So practice is a few to start. Be receptive to criticism. And then like Coach say, man, don't wait for your turn to talk, man. We think we here to pick on you? We saw you step wrong. Now Coach, huh? Really do? I'm telling you, I saw you step wrong, and you could rebut that, like for real, like if you didn't step wrong. So I'm just picking on you. That's what I'm doing. My oh, man, take criticism, man. Apply that. Well, I used to be like this in my coach. I used to be like this in my coach face, man, because I want to know how can I get better. I don't feel like I arrived. I don't feel like I'm the shit. I want, I want that instruction, man. Give it to me. What can I do better? Be that dude, man. Don't be that dude just because of. Because you get criticized in front of your boy. That's what this game is about. It's about constant growth, man. Constantly getting better. So be able to take criticism, man. Don't be all coach, coach, coach. No. Coach saw me, so bleed out. Bleed. Just, just, just trust me. And finish the play. Finish the play. Six seconds of work. Like I said, Rod the Rod, he already got that going for him, man. And just because I saw that with the naked eye, I just, just jumped out on the screen for me. And that's another thing. Be that flash on the screen. They will come to see some time, they see somebody, you come to see somebody else, but you just that flash on the screen. So finish the play. That's what that's about. Finish the play.